Hi guys, welcome to the Fight Age channel. Sam Jones, the manager of the undefeated British heavyweight Joe Joyce, predicted that the owner of the WBA, WBO and IBF titles Anthony Joshua will prematurely defeat the mandatory challenger for the WBO belt Alexander Usyk. At the same time, Jones believed that Joshua needs to be included from the start in this fight. According to the manager, in a long fight Usyk will have chances to win. Anthony Joshua, the WBA, WBO and IBF World Heavyweight Champion, continues to publish photos on social networks showing his solid form ahead of the fight against the mandatory WBO title contender Alexander Usyk. One of the recent posts of the British boxer on Instagram attracted the attention of former world champion Shannon Briggs, who admired his form comparing AJ to a Tesla car. British heavyweight Salomon Dacres, who worked with WBA, WBO and IBF world champion Anthony Joshua as a sparring partner, shared his expectations from the upcoming fight of his compatriot with the mandatory challenger for the WBO belt Alexander Usyk. According to Dacres, in this confrontation Joshua will be able to strangle his opponent. In the second half of the fight, former world champion in the first heavyweight Grigory Drost believed that the undefeated Ukrainian heavyweight Alexander Usyk will be able to arrange an upset in the upcoming fight with Anthony Joshua. According to Drost, in this confrontation he will root for Usyk, whom he considers one of the best boxers in the world. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then you receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my channel. I am trying very hard absolutely every day and I need your support. Your likes, comments, reposts to social networks. Thanks to everyone who subscribes to my channel. You are my support. Thank you so much. On the eve of this fight, Meraz gives everyone who registered using my link with the promo code FightEdge a 100% bonus just for registering. You can bet money. All the details are in my Telegram channel, but you need to subscribe. Thank you for your attention. Now we start the video. Sam Jones, the manager of the undefeated British heavyweight Joe Joyce, predicted that the owner of the WBA, WBO and IBF titles Anthony Joshua will prematurely defeat the mandatory challenger for the WBO belt Alexander Usyk. At the same time, Jones believed that Joshua needs to be included from the start in this fight. According to the manager, in a long fight Usyk will have chances to win. To be honest, I think that Joshua will iron out the Usyk. This is my forecast, but again, the longer the fight lasts, the more profitable it will be for Usyk. In my opinion, Joshua should not allow Usyk to get into its rhythm. It seems to me that Anthony will be ready properly and will win by knockout, Sam Jones said in an interview. Anthony Joshua, the WBA, WBO and IBF World Heavyweight Champion continues to publish photos on social networks, showing his solid form ahead of the fight against the mandatory WBO title contender Alexander Usyk. One of the recent posts of the British boxer on Instagram attracted the attention of former world champion Shannon Briggs, who admired his form comparing AJ to a Tesla car. Look at him, conditions are confidence, champion, you are machine, you are Tesla champ, have a rest, eat right and your mind will prepare itself for anything, hard times give birth to strong people, you are machine, Anthony, train, eat, sleep, repeat. Shannon Briggs wrote in the comments under Joshua's post. British heavyweight Salomon Dacres, who worked with the WBA, WBO and IBA world champion Anthony Joshua as a sparring partner, shared his expectations from the upcoming fight of his compatriot with the mandatory challenger for the WBO belt Alexander Usyk. According to Dacres, in this confrontation Joshua will be able to strangle his opponent in the second half of the fight. I think that Joshua can stop Usyk in the period from the middle of the fight to be late round. It seems to me that Anthony will immediately turn on his backhand. Joshua has power. As soon as he delivers a few blows, it will cause serious damage. I believe that in the interval between the middle of the fight and the late rounds, Joshua can win," Solomon Dacre said in an interview. 
Former world champion in the first heavyweight Grigory Drost believed that the undefeated Ukrainian heavyweight Alexander Usyk will be able to arrange an upset in the upcoming fight with the owner of the WBA, WBO and IBF titles Anthony Joshua. According to Drost, in this confrontation he will root for Usyk, whom he considers one of the best boxers in the world. I am waiting for a sensation. Of course, I support Alexander Usyk and I like him. I consider him one of the most talented boxers in the heavyweight division and boxing in general. I would like him to prove that the impossible is possible. In fact, not everyone manages to rise from cruisers to heavyweight. We all know who Anthony Joshua is. I believe in Usyk and I expect a spectacle from this fight. Grigory Droz said in an interview. The WBC World Heavyweight Champion Tyson Fury met an attack on the head of the mushroom boxing promotion company Heidi Hearn. Hearn had the opportunity to sign me. In my opinion, in one of his interviews, he said that most of all in his life he regrets that he did not sign with Gypsy King. I like to terrorize Heidi because he likes to talk nonsense about people he has never worked with. Eddie has always done nothing but talk nonsense about me, because he knows that this will bring his interviews. After all, what has he achieved in this life? He was never a boxer. Eddie hangs around like he is the heavyweight champion of the world. But he's not. He is just a businessman. There are many such people, but there is only one real world heavyweight champion. Me, Tyson Fury said. The head of the mushroom boxing promotion company Eddie Hearn believes that the WBC world heavyweight champion Tyson Fury should be stripped of the title if his fight with American Dante Wilder doesn't take place in October. I 100% want to fight between Fury and Wilder to take place, because I want the winner to finally be determined in their confrontation, so that we can again try to organize a unification match with Anthony Joshua. But if this does not happen, then the WBC should take action against Fury, namely deprive him of the title. Tyson has not boxed since February 2020, and if he does not fight in October, it will be almost two years since his last performance. He should be strapped to his title or transferred to the status of champion on vacation. Dillian White has been sitting as the interim champion all this time and waiting for his turn. I understand that the pandemic has made his own adjustments. But when a champion doesn't perform for two years, then measures need to be taken, said Hearn. Former WBC heavyweight champion Dante Wilder is confined that in his abilities on the eve of a rematch with Tyson Fury, which is scheduled to take place on October 9 in Las Vegas. I'm a danger at this point in time, Wilder said during the broadcast. Malik Scott and my team have brought out the beast in me, and I'm ready as never before. But it doesn't mean anything if you can show it to the rest of the world, and I'm well aware of that. Just don't blink, guys, just don't blink, said Dante Wilder. Former world champion in the first heavyweight and commentator Johnny Nelson believed that the expected mega fight for the title of absolute heavyweight champion between Tyson Fury and Anthony Joshua will not take place. If you look at the events after a while, we have been told for a very long time that a deal is about to take place, and the only person who has silent, which was a lesson for me, was Anthony Joshua. Has he ever said anything about what should be? When you have two fighters with statements, the negotiations are completed successfully. And other think that this fight still has a chance. The problem is that the teams do not trust each other. In fact, they never agree to the end. Now there is no question of a fight. And it frightens both the guys, Nelson said. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel.